Many local businesses are feeling the effects of the coronavirus outbreak, and a lot of them sit right at Captain Anderson's marina. News 13's Courtney Mims tells us how the marina is handling this unusual situation. Normally on a sunny day like today, you'd see boats at Captain Anderson's marina coming and going. But for now, most of them are docked up and not going anywhere. Just another victim of the coronavirus outbreak. Feels like a hurricane without the bad weather. <laughs> Captain Anderson's marina opened up on March 1st for the season, only to have things halted just 17 days later, affecting not just the marina itself, but the 49 businesses who operate in it as well. Many unsure of when they'll be able to start taking trips again. It'll take a while for tourism to pick up because that's not going to be the first thing on people's minds. It's going, they're going to be getting their children back in school. They're going to get it, be taking all of their things that they took home from work uh, back to their offices. One of the charters it's affecting is the long shot. Captain Alicia Paul says she's thankful she's able to do commercial trips because that's her only source of income right now. Typically we're, we're all running twice a day right now and we're, you see that we're all tied up so it's, it's drastically impairing us financially. It's a strange situation for these captains who haven't seen the marina like this before. As far as seeing all these boats tied up permanently um, as they are right now, I've, I've never witnessed that in my entire career and I've been right here fishing my entire life. Well, Captain Anderson's marina hopes to have things back up and running normally as soon as possible, but they are taking it day by day right now. Reporting in Panama City Beach, Courtney Mims, News 13, Panhandle Strong.